Hello, this is Levi from Amish Made Poly. Today I'm going to be showing you how to assemble your two-foot Adirondack swivel glider. So I'm going to start with the seat here. The easiest way is to set it up on its side and we're going to grab the arm and it will lay right on top here and the holes will line up with the holes here in the frame there. So I'm going to grab the short bolt here and a washer. The washer always goes on first. I'm going to slide that through the hole in the front of the arm here. It'll slide right in. And I'll grab another one, uh, the one of the short bolts, and another washer go in the front there as well. It'll slide right in. So I'm going to put another washer on the bottom there, and then the nut will go in right after that. And we'll just do everything finger tight for now. And whenever we get finished, we'll tighten everything up at once. So washer will go on first there, and then the nut. And another washer and another nut for the other one there. All right, now we've got the really long bolts. We'll go here in this part as well. So we'll put the washer on first. We'll slide it through the hole there. Oh, another long bolt and a washer. It's right through, so we'll good. And we'll do the same thing on this side here. Lay the arm up there. And again on the front here, we use the short bolts and a washer. And another bolt and a washer. And then we'll put the washer on first. And then the nut. And then the other bolt as well, the washer on first. And then the nut. All right, now we're ready to put the back on. So we're gonna go ahead and set this thing And then here in this part as well, we'll get to put the washer on and then the long bolts go in the back. And we do not stick the washer and the nut on the other side yet because these bolts will go all the way through the back of the chair then as well. So slide that through. Uh, another long bolt and a washer. And there as well. All right, so on the back, we'll start by putting these two bolts in here first. That way it'll hang and then it'll swivel down and we can bolt that in there as well. So I'll grab one of the one of the medium bolts. There's a small, a medium, and a large, so this would be the medium size. And a washer. Alright, so these should line up here with the hole in the back there. And then we'll put the washer on first, and then the nut. Same on this side, we'll, the washer will go on first, and then the nut. And this will swivel down here, we'll pull these bolts, push these back through, They're sticking out there on both sides. And this will swivel in, and then we just Make sure everything's lined up there. And that should push right through. And the same on this side, we're just going to push them through. And then the washer will go in first. And then the nut. And the same with that one, the washer. And then the nut. We've got it 
these over there on that side to do as well. So put the washers on first, and then the nuts. Perfect. Alrighty, so now we got the chair fully assembled. Now we just need to attach it to the swivel base here. So we will just pick it up and set it right on top and then we'll slide the bolts through the holes here with the holes in the base of the chair here. So we'll just grab that. Alrighty, so I've got one of these shorter bolts here with a washer on it. And that'll slide through the hole here and then put it through the hole there. Then the washer will go on first, and then the nut. And again, we're just doing them finger tight for now, and we'll tighten them down whenever we have all of them attached. And it's easiest if you do the two front or the two back first, instead of doing the two on the sides first as well. So go ahead and swivel that around here. Again, I've got a bolt with a washer. We'll go through the hole here. And that will go through this hole then as well. Then the washer will go on first, and then the nut. And now right from the back, a bolt with a washer will go through there, and that will And then the washer will go on first, and then the nut. Same on this side, put the, slide the bolt through the hole there. And then the washer will go on first as well. And then the nut. Great, now we're ready to tighten all those four down again. So we'll use a half inch wrench and ratchet. You can just use two wrenches if that's what you have available. So we'll just tighten these down. And there you have it.